The European Commission has decided to take a strong stance against Hungary. It calls on EU countries to freeze 7.5 billion euros of EU cohesion funds, as the country has not made enough progress with its reforms against corruption. Hungary's 5.8 billion euro recovery plan has been approved, but payments will be suspended unless reforms are implemented thoroughly. So in total, 13 billion euros are at stake. Hungary has unfortunately not implemented the remedial measures so that we could say that the risks we identified have gone away. We conclude therefore that we maintain, as it stands, our proposal on the budgetary protection measures. The frozen funds can only be blocked if 27 conditions are met, from strengthening the anti-corruption framework in Hungary to improving the independence of the judiciary. The Hungarian government is furious with this decision, but the Hungarian opposition welcome the proposal and hope that EU member states will too. In the last 10 years, billions of euros came to Hungary, but the healthcare is in a worse situation than 10 years ago. The education is in a worse situation. The competitiveness of the country did not increase because all these funds went to three, four oligarchs. Now with this decision, we can stop this process. EU finance ministers will have to pass this text by qualified majority. But the vote will be timed so that other issues that Hungary has been blocking won't continue to be held up, like releasing funds for Ukraine or holding up a deal on a global corporate tax. Maeve McMahon, Euro News, Brussels. The Hungarian opposition welcome the proposal and hope EU member states will too.